Ida, leaving behind a sea of problems. Just mind blowing right now. Calvin Melendez woke up to a call from his family, who lives above his first floor unit at Mohegan Commons in Norwich. Right now it just keeps accumulating because it keeps coming from the toilets and the tubs. So we got maybe about two inches right now. It's pretty wild. Like I feel bad for the people that live right, right back there. They have a house. Their car is like, this is the roof right here. This is the water. I just walked out there, right? I've got low, low rain boots on. Let's see if I can get it off and just give you an idea. I mean, the water, that's, that's how deep it is. It's ridiculous. I didn't think this could happen around here but anything can happen. But from one building to the next, both in the same complex, a very different experience. I just woke up and getting ready to go to work. When I step outside, and I see water everywhere. Eddie Morrow stopping to take a photo of what is usually the road he takes for his morning commute. Lucky I am in my apartment, there's nothing wrong. There's no water in there. Morrow saying he feels for those who were not as fortunate as he was, but adds it's hurricane season and we have to expect the unexpected. Everybody know every here we got to we got to go through this because this is the season. So we just got to get ourselves ready. And ready or not, the storm is over, but the cleanup is far from it. In Norwich, I'm Margot Farrell, Fox 61 News.